Fernando County alumni of a local high school are sharing their memories of former President Jimmy Carter. The 98-year-old is now in hospice, living out his last days. News Channel 8's Annie Mapp joins us live in Brooksville. And how is the former president being remembered, Annie? Those who were in the Hernando High School marching band in 1977 say they will never forget being the only band in the state of Florida selected to perform at former President Jimmy Carter's inauguration. This is um, Dee McClung. He was the head drum major. <laughs> A mini class reunion where former Hernando High School marching band members and their band director recalled a big moment in their lives. We're from a small town. This was nothing that, you know, we would ever expect mm -hmm. that we would get to do. A group of nearly 200 students invited to take their talents to Washington, D.C. to perform for President Jimmy Carter's inauguration in January 1977. But to take the trip, the band had to raise over $45,000 in a month's time. And the town just, and the community, the county all jumped in, donated money, uh, and um, we had one fundraiser right after another, from picking oranges to uh, <laughs> fish fries, dinners, car washes. For many students, it was their first trip outside of Florida and first time seeing snow. Um, even to this day, I still tell people and they're like, really? With former President Carter now living out his last days in hospice care, the alums are thankful they got the experience. Enough time has elapsed that, that the community doesn't remember that we went and that we were part of his political career, basically, from our presidential career uh, from start. And, till now and and some of the band members I spoke with are actually traveling to Washington DC this week and say this trip will bring back memories especially with the recent news of former President Carter reporting live in Hernando County Annie map eight on your side